All right, guys, so um, I'm going to talk to you about the importance of getting proper rest and a quick review of the uh, product that uh, helps you with that. Now, uh, first, let me congratulate uh, Ricky and Damien. Uh, they got uh, first and second place, respectively, in the drawing for uh, the July giveaway. Uh, congrats, guys. Mailed your stuff out today, um, so you should be getting it uh, Ricky Monday and Damien on Tuesday next week. All right. Um, wearing a mask is making is, is causing this just wave to uh, to appear in my beard, and it's driving me crazy because I can't get it straight now because it has the mask indentation. All right. So, um, sleep. Now, those of you that don't know me or may not know this... Uh, I have anxiety, so I take something for anxiety, and uh, anxiety a lot of times leads to uh, insomnia. But I also have hyperinsomnia, which means I take two prescription drugs. Well, this is this is for the other thing: two prescription drugs and a natural um, over-the-counter uh, um, melatonin to sleep. So um, I take three things to get sleep. Um, I have a very hard time staying asleep. Uh, it's very rare for me to get um, like a deep sleep, and uh, it's just, it's, it's frustrating. It's very frustrating to just sit there in the bed because you need sleep to recover. That's a vital process uh, for the human body um, to be able to recover from exercise, work stress, everything for you to be able to create uh, memories, create uh, those synapses um, that are going to create that memory strain, um, memorization, things like that. Um, sleep is kind of the key to all of that. So, I've had trouble sleeping forever. Um, in fact, uh, it was so hard for me to sleep at one point that when I worked in law enforcement, all I ever wanted to work was the night shift uh, because somehow I could get some kind of sleep during the day. Um, I'm supposed to work in these regular nights. But, uh, okay, so um, it's been rough and it's frustrating because I, I, you want to sleep. It's like you feel you can sleep. Like I, in the middle of the day, I'm like, I could just sleep right now. Um, I, you get home, I have dinner, I go to the bed and I'm just like, ah, oh, crap, now I can't sleep or something pops in my head, you know? So, um, I'm trying, uh, to get off the prescription medications or the reliance on them and have, you know, cycle a few days on, cycle a few days off. And, uh, I had tried, um, the over the counter sleep medication. You can get it like Walmart. Um, and it, um, it kind of works. I, I mean, I, I say kind of works because, you know, on average, I might, if I'm lucky, get, you know, maybe a good four or five hours um, total. Uh, so, you know, I, I may be lucky enough to do that. But I finally gave in because uh, I had read uh, Up on Fade Out. And um, it's just expensive. It's 50 bucks. And I'm like, you know, there's no way, you know, I'm already on prescription stuff. And um, I've been on it for quite a while. So, I was like, there's no way something natural out there is going to help me sleep better. So, but it came up on the BOGO, so, or the 50% uh, off day. And I'm like, you know what? It's going to be 25 bucks. Let me try it out. That way I can kind of cycle off these, uh, these, these prescription medications. And I'm not taking them every day because um, you develop both a physical addiction and a psychological one. And they're different. Physical addiction and psychological addiction are different in that um, psychologically you're craving it because of the brain, but physically because it's it's your body needs it. So they're two different kinds, and um, I'm at a point where I don't want to ever have to just you know be be a slave to these. And uh, I tried it. I, I just got it in. What's today? Friday. So we got it in Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Use it three days. And uh, the first day, um, I didn't take one of the, the prescription meds. I took the other one, the one that's, I have one that knocks me out and one that's supposed to keep me asleep. Um, and then uh, I take the melatonin. So this has melatonin in it. So um, that day I didn't take the melatonin or the one that's supposed to knock me out. And I fell asleep in like 20 minutes. Like after taking it, literally fell asleep in like 20 minutes. And um, like weird, weird, uh, like, I have never gotten, like, it, it's been such a long time since I've gotten sleep. Um, where my, my, The dreams are weird. Like, it's straight up, they're weird dreams, but it's because I have not reached that level of deep REM, okay? Uh, rapid eye movement cycle, sleep, in forever. Hold on, the TV's cussing this blue light. All right, in forever. So I had, like, weird, vivid dreams, but I slept pretty good. I got, like, six hours, which is good for me. So I'm like, you know what? 
maybe it was just you know power of the mind tried it again um that that the next night and um same thing got my you know got six which is good six hours compared to you know usually getting four to five um because i will wake up in the middle of the night and uh well you know just not be able to go back to sleep so i'll come downstairs do things like that so i still wake up at my usual time i wake up at like two or three because I, I get hungry come down have a protein shake but you know i came down had my protein shake went back upstairs right back to sleep whereas you know usually i'd be down here and just you know watching the clock tick and be like, man, I got to be up at this time. And, you know, I'm still down here. I'd go upstairs, just lay in the bed and nothing happens. So I took it again, again, vivid dreams. And it's not like a bad thing. Like I, I'm all about nightmares, all about, you know, really. But these dreams are like, it feels like I'm actually getting that good dream sleep. Whereas it was just like before they were just like small little. So these are much more vivid dreams. So I, I, I to me, that's a, that's a good thing. Um, some of you may not want vivid very vivid dreams but um i'm getting the rest so i took it again and um last night man we crashed out at 11 and i woke up at uh six well i woke up had my protein shake woke up at about 6 50 so i just got seven hours of sleep so um i'm gonna try it tonight since it's friday and i don't have to wake up uh, specifically to work in the morning tomorrow i do have to wake up to go to the gym but um see if you know without any of the prescription stuff how, how I can get some rest, how well it works um, for that. Because, uh, I mean, obviously I'm probably just, you know, used to all that stuff, but it's it's got a lot of good products. I looked them all up. You know, I used to work at uh, GNC and vitamin stores two, two decades ago. But uh, all these products are ones that are going to help you with that uh, sleep cycle. And it also has the melatonin in it. Um, honestly, highly recommend it. Well worth 25 bucks. Um, if not, if not for just the last three days of dreams, like I have not had cool, just deep dreams like that in a long time. And, uh, I, I don't know if you can see the smile on my face because if you've ever suffered from insomnia, you don't get that and you don't, you don't wake up refreshed. You didn't get that deep, deep, just crazy dream sleep, um, that, that helps you rest. And, uh, that's, you know, getting the, that, that whole brain going and that rapid eye movement happening. So I, I'm definitely psyched, I'm excited, I'm happy I made the purchase. Um, highly recommend it to you guys, uh, just to try it out. I mean, if you have that, because obviously if you're training and you're working out and you're working at work and you're stressing and you're not getting sleep, it's not good for your immune system. Your immune system takes a shit, your recovery takes a shit, and uh, your body just goes a shit. So you have to find that kind of, you know, eat, train, sleep. That's the, the main one. Sleep is one of them, all right? You got to eat and train, but sleep is the, the, the other component to it, and it's one of the more important ones. So that's my review on Fade Out. The, the flavor, I got the black currant. I think I'm saying that right. Currant. Currant. Um, it's it's a different flavor. It's not horrible. I mixed it with a little bit of water, drank it. Kind of like a minty, minty flavor kind of gave me, like a fruit mint flavor. It wasn't bad. It wasn't bad. I ordered the pineapple as well um that hasn't gotten here yet though so i haven't tried that flavor but um fade out give it a try guys i'll put the link down below um i'm just happy like these last three days have been pretty good so that should just tell you something about the product uh i would uh like i said it's expensive though so um always try to you know get the the discount i believe bigger 30 or uh red I think they have Red 30 is this weekend. Bigger 30 usually works all the time for me for 30% off. Um, I'm not looking at my more, if, if you're looking at this and this was posted a while back, look at my more recent videos. I usually give you guys the discount code I have uh, for that month that is more than the 20% that I can usually give. All right, so that is Fade Out by Redcon 1 for you guys. Um, yeah, I, I got to give it a, a 5 out of 5, 10 out of 10. Um, I, I, nothing wrong with it. It's, you know, got, even has some antioxidants in it. Um, it has zinc, which is good for you. Um, immune system wise, recovery wise, wound healing wise, um, reproductive cycle. It has the ZMA complex. If you guys have ever heard of that, that's also one of those things, the uh, zinc magnesium that help you uh, sleep. So uh, it's a combination. It's good. It's got, a, I mean, a bit of everything, you know, ZMA was sold in their studies showing, you know, that zinc magnesium aspartate help you sleep. Um, it's got GABA, which is, you know, helps with the neurotransmitter in the brains, um, arginine as well, and a bunch of other, uh, I guess it has melatonin and a bunch of other herbs that are, you know, that you take usually in teas to calm you. Um, so chamomile, valerian, 
So, uh, highly recommend it. Y'all have a great day. I'm going to end it right here. Um, again, congrats, Ricky, Damien. Um, awesome job. And uh, keep trucking, guys.